This is the spectacular Oregon coast, located southwest of Portland. It's a really special place to our family because we have been visiting here since I was born. We especially love the Oregon Coast Aquarium. That's a starfish. We have been coming here since I was a teeny tiny little girl. In fact, some of my best memories were made here. I actually fell into this very pond when I was about two years old. This is Bindi doing the river dance. Did you fall in? As I've grown up and become more involved with Australia Zoo life, I definitely love to visit these kind of facilities to gain more ideas to take back home. So today I'm really excited to learn some new techniques and also catch up with some old friends. <laughs> Hi guys, how's it going? <laughs> Good boy! Good job! <laughs> Max is a really special sea lion. He is such a massive old man. He has been here my entire life. Max. Yeah, He's Max. The only one I Max. 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 Was that Max? How is he doing? He is doing really, really well. Being 29 years old is much older than what they would be living out in the wild. They typically will live out in the wild up to their late teens or so. He has the biggest, most beautiful brown eyes in the world. He's like, I it's, know they are. It's like he just stares into your soul. He does, doesn't he? Well, it is so good to see you, Max. Bye, buddy. Thank you. Bye, buddy. I'm about to do an ultrasound on a spiny dogfish shark. This is definitely going to be a first for me. I can't wait. So this is the behind the scenes area. And over here is actually our, one of our medical pools. So this is how we add new fish and do medical treatments. That's incredible. Yeah, they're really great. Wow. So Bindi in here we have our female dogfish sharks. We acquired these dogfish sharks from another aquarium and they've spent the last three months in quarantine. So they're ready to go into our big shark exhibit with the other sharks, but before they do, we have to know whether they're pregnant or not pregnant. So today we're gonna try and get Dottie. She's a mature female. The female sharks, they do have eggs, but they all grow inside the female. Yeah. And then the pups hatch live, and they oh, can be in there almost two years. So it's a very long gestational term. Wow. And then they give birth to anywhere between seven and 15 pups. Oh and the last goodness. one had 15. Wow. So yeah. it's really important that you know what's going on before they get into their new pond. It is. These sharks are classified as vulnerable in the wild. So if Dottie is pregnant, then it'll be great news. However, we don't want Dottie to have shark pups in the main shark tank. They'd be at risk of being attacked by the other larger sharks. If she is not pregnant though, she'll go onto the spectacular on display open seas area. This open seas exhibit will give her lots of new friends and areas to explore. Our first step is getting Dottie from her quarantine area. It definitely can be difficult depending on the demeanor of the shark. Here we go, I'm gonna go really slowly. Our amazing team here is so extraordinary because they know the shark's behaviors. So they're gonna watch Dottie and see what her swimming pattern is until they're able to get that lovely sling around her, pull her out and get her to her little holding area. You can see they're just gonna position themselves in a way that she'll, she'll swim, swim right in. in. so 
incredibly fast. Yes. Well done. Successful. Got it. Just let all that water drain out. All right. Trying to help you out here. It's a lot lighter without the water. <laughs> all right, and then we're just gonna lift her up pretty high into this trough. And we're gonna actually let her out of this stretcher. Okay. So she can just kind of like that. down. Beautiful. Hi, girl, I know. When you flip her and she attains tonic immobility, when she relaxes, you let us know, we'll start the timer and we'll start our scan. So we'll have about three minutes with her in tonic immobility before flipping her back over. Instead of using ultrasound gel, we're gonna use the water to show us an image. That's so I don't brilliant. have to have gel. If she's not pregnant, she'll go onto the spectacular on display open seas area. We only have three minutes with Dottie to get this ultrasound. All right, you can start the timer, Brittany. So what we'll do is we'll start here at her heart. Uh -huh. So you can see her heart pumping here. Oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah. there's some skeletal muscle. Yes. 30 seconds. And then her, uh, her ova are gonna be on these round parts on her side. So Take nice. a look. All right. Respiration Thank you, there. love. You mm -hmm. Here we go, got it. No flushing on the underside. There you go. So I'll hold it just like that? Yep. Just from here? Yep. Okay. Perfect. I'm just going to record what you're doing. One minute. I'm trying so to leave I a bit of water. Liver. Yeah. Keep going all the way down. Okay. This is an ova. Wow, yeah. Yeah. So go ahead more towards her side. Towards her side over yeah. here? Perfect. Right there? Yep, I don't see any babies yet. No little ones? Let's like see her other side. Her other side? No, nope, wow. that's her, this is her colon. Uh -huh. That's her spiral colon, which is cool. Wow, that's really cool. 130? I don't see any babies in there. She might not have little ones. She might not. Why don't you turn it up a long ways and we can go down, scan down her body that way. 230? I think we're done with the ultrasound. Right. I don't see any babies in there. So you can flip her back over. Oh, that's amazing. Oh my there she goes. Oh, she's so amazing. And she's back out of it. She's back to normal. And she's perfect. Yeah, she's perfect. She did really well. Yeah. It's official. Dottie isn't pregnant, which is great news. Because she can be released into the gorgeous and expansive area, which is a vast space for her to get to swim with many other friends. Crikey, that was amazing. Click here to watch more clips. Click here to see more from Animal Planet. And for full episodes of your favorite shows, click here to go to Animal Planet Go.